speaking of the race, though, we were thinking about how is Oliver Hoare going to do? How is Centrowitz going to do? But the man who stole the show was the man who got fourth in the race? Was it fourth? Cameron Myers, age 16. You can look at this finish. He's in the... He's ch- I guess he gets third. He's like in that mm-hmm. chase pack. Yeah. Runs 355, breaking a world record for fastest mile at age 16 or younger. 355, a record that was 356 and held by Jakob Ingebrigtsen. So... A lot of times you look at records, you're like, who held the record? Is it like a legit record? Because, you know, the person has a 10 mile, uh, the 10 year old age group record is not like. <laughs> the 10 the ten year old 10 mile record yeah, is tough. Whatever. Yeah. So, but if you look at these records, Jakob started holding the record at age 16 and mm-hmm. then he clearly got better and better. Well, Hawker has it at age 19. I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, age 16, it was 356. Now it's 355 by the Aussie, Cameron Myers. Yeah. I think it was his first time breaking four as well. Does it in February? Man, is 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 he going to, you know, are we going to look out like four years from now and all of a sudden we're going to see Cameron Myers out there running sub 330, 1500s and, you know, being the next big, you know, dominant mid-distance mm. runner? So at the end of January, he ran 340 for 1500. Yeah. So he was in, in this range. Took advantage of the fact that this was a good field. Like the way he closed there. You see, though, the difference, right, between age 16 and age 17 with Jakob Ingebrigtsen. He, Ingebrigtsen, and maybe it's because he just didn't run. Oh, no. His 1500 gets way faster, too. I was going to say maybe he shouldn't run a mile. His 1500 goes from 339 to 331, 16 to 17. And his mile goes 356 to 352. So at 331... Is even more impressive. So basically, by 17, he was running a 348 equivalent mile. So the expectation should not be that, right? That's way too I don't high. Know. I think he could run 352 next year. That's right. He could, but that's a huge, huge burden to put on somebody sure, who's sure. still developing in the sport. What made Inga Britson special is you're right. He started from this phenom standpoint, and then he just kept getting better. Just didn't As if he was someone who had just picked up the sport and hadn't been running for years. He was like the first one to ever have truly linear progression. <laughs> like, just every year he got older, he just got right. better. There was no, like, oh, uh, stagnant. He was just like, nope, a year yeah. older, a year better. A year older, a year better. And then just now he's at the best. Yeah. it's You think about the phenoms. Let's just say Ingebrigtsen, Sydney, Mondo. Really good from a young age. And a lot, of, but then you say, oh, a lot of people were good from a young age. They were better than everybody else from a young age. But then they just kept improving. Yeah, they kept incru- improving in a way as if someone had just discovered the sport in high school. Hey, I PR'd again. They kept doing that on top of how good they already were. Man, Aussie though, they're they're doing pretty well. So that was that was my other takeaway. Australia golden era of mid distance running after the four by two k relay at World Cross. McSwain made this joke: Kenya, Ethiopia, Australia, the big three. I don't know. Maybe. I mean, maybe he's looking into the future. Who? Who's there? What's their four by mile right now? So, McSwain, McSwain, Hoare, Hoare. Ramsden, Ramsden, and then is it? Is it? Is it Myers? Is it Cameron Myers? Is he on the squad? Three fifty five is pretty legit. Is he like the when they put like LeBron James on Team USA when he was like eighteen type thing? <laughs> Let me look at twenty twenty two. Let's. There's, there might be a name that we're missing here. An obvious one. Men's 1500, 2022. Australia. Look at this. You're finding it. Boom, boom. Almost there. Ace not, the not Austria. Not Austria. It can be confusing. Also, every time I type out the word Australia, I spell it wrong every single time. So this is the top group. Hoare, McSwain, Hunter, Peter Bull, and Ramsden is five. So I guess we you could include Charlie Hunter in there. Yeah. In the 15. Well, Hunter's now also more of an eight guy. So. Well, he, he always was more of an eight guy, wasn't he? Yeah. Jack Antsy as well. They got a lot of they got a lot of depth. Ozzy's good. They have a good DMR. That race was cool. You talked about Centrowitz, Myers, and Hors, three different eras. All yeah. in one race, three different ways Past, to look present, at future. one result. 